in that Mystic is a lot better than quite a few of the teams they played during this uh, EMS qualifier. Well, we'll have to see this time they go into the bomb site. PRB and Skirk picking up kills left and right, and PRB is going to end it with a triple kill. And now, well, Hearts is kind of making his way in here, but I'm not sure he expects anything much from it. Mark is even just going to pick him down straight away. But then we saw the Frenchman equalize it to 3-on-3, three three, so this is still anybody's round. Yeah, I gotta be careful here, and obviously with a shot like that from Kiyoshima bringing down Polly finally, it is back to a, uh, well now back to a 2 on 4 situation as Hoyland takes down another one, Hearts is waiting here with the AWP, gets the shot on PRB, and now let's see, can they really make it into this bomb site? Mark is waiting, and he's actually the only one who's here, peeks out, gets a great shot off, and now Kiyoshima, he may have got the kill, but he's in a 1 on 2, half HP, he has got the bomb and he really wants to put it down, and that would at least give them some money to buy for the next round. So he's got that secured. Now one-on-two situation. He takes one down. It's down to a one-on-one. -on -one. He sprays. He gets the kill. All four of them. Great round from Kiyoshima. And that's going to be Clan Mystic now taking a fifth round. A way of frag to offer like Kinyas. Because that just kind of feeds his addiction of, <laughs> of killing people with the off. All right. We'll see how that goes. If he can... If he can uh maybe extinguish that thirst here. Hoyland comes through, gets taken down by Superfighter and immediately, instantly, Polly goes down as well. And now if Mark dies here, that will probably be the end of the round. He's gonna make a run for it. And actually H2K Gaming, they're five on three. That's a great shot and another one coming in from PRP. I was gonna say maybe they should run away, but those two kills in return make a big difference. Now they can sense it. They wanna go for it. It's back to a three on three. They try and make it happen here. GMX gets caught up, but he takes the kill on Mark, gets a double kill on Skirk, and now it's PRP triple from GMX. In fact, a quad kill in total and that's the round from clan mystic so no they shouldn't three on three situation there is no kit picked up currently on clan mystic so they got to move quickly mark is going to take down hearts it's back to a two on three mark comes in with a second great headshot on gmx and now super fighter who's got the only kill so actually well him and uh, gmx were the only two to get any kills there nice round from h2k completely outplaying clan mystic it feels to me like whenever they find something that is working, then the next round it, it kind of doesn't work and uh, they're not really stringing many rounds together here. They're winning individual rounds every once in a while on the Norwegian side, but that's not quite good enough. This time, great opening though, Skirk with a fantastic double kill, and that's going to allow them entrance into the bomb site. Kiyoshima and GMX, they're in a 2 on 3. Do you want to go for it here? Oh yeah, they have nothing to lose. They have lots of money to, to work with, even if they lose this round, and they've got that cushion of having match point really from now on and out. Skirk with a triple, can he go for the quad kill? He can, nice headshot. And that's Skirk individually just stepping it up. I mean, no luck at all to Mystic so far. Polly's gonna take down GMX. Two on three, this is a brilliant round from Clan Mystic so far. They're gonna get the bomb down as well. Now how can they retake this? Polly spots the one, but he can't get the shot and his teammate goes down. And now it's alone for Polly here in a one on two situation. He tries to find the shot on somebody. He has to see set 75 out. If he can find Kiyoshima up close, he shoots before he turns the corner. Absolutely brilliant play. And now he just has to defuse the bomb as well. SF is far away. There's going to be the grenade. SF not walking into it. The defuse comes in. He's still defusing. Two, one. He's going to get it. And Polly actually does it in a one on three. He gets a triple kill and defuses the bomb. He gets killed, but it doesn't matter. H2K are standing in their way. They're going to run through the fire, and Rubino goes down to it. It's actually worth it, even though they take a lot of damage on Superfighter. That's a great sacrifice to make. Superfighter picking up another kill. There's Polly with a quick double in return, and it's back to a 2 on 3 The bomb, they want to get that down quickly, but Skirk is up on the high ground. Hoyland is coming in. Skirk, can he walk through at the right time? He takes down the bomb just as it gets planted, and it's back to a 2 on 2 Hoyland gets the one, and now it's a one-on-one. -on -one. Super Fighter, sorry, he got a quad kill. Can he really make this an ace? He's trying. He's throwing out flashes and everything, but the bomb is taking away. He wants to get out of here, and this is definitely a smart move. Skirk now has to find him and get the defuse in, and this is not going to be easy for the Norwegian player. This could be the big breakthrough for Clan Mystic if they could come in and win this round. Super is waiting right here. Skrook is trying to wall bank through. He's not finding him just yet. And now he's going to go for the defuse. Super Fighter comes out, peeks, he goes down. And there's enough time for Skrook, I think. No, no there is not. Super Fighter, quad kill, and the bomb goes soft. Man, I thought he just had it. And SF actually got that quad kill with one HP. They had four people out, uh, which makes no sense to me, but. I guess that's the kind of decisions you see yeah, from time to time in CS games. I mean, that, I, I did not, ag I would not agree with that decision to rush that upper bomb site after you, put, you know, they're definitely gonna, they definitely knew that Polly had an off. 
Yeah, I mean, obviously, having uh, having that orb is um, it's also an expensive investment, so cruising it like that. But <laughs> what is Rubino doing to this game? He's got a quad kill already. He was basically in a one on five, and he actually gets the ace. Oh my lord. What? How on earth does this happen? Did Rubino just win this map for H2K? That was there... a 1v5 eco ace. What? From hell there, but actually, oh no, just falls back into the side. That's not good. It was supposed to fire to go a little bit further than that here. Hearts is still flashed. They're gonna come through. Kenny picks off one. Kenny picks off two. He goes for the triple. He's gonna get all three, and the push is crushed. Kenny almost gets the grenade kill as well, but it's gonna be GMX to pick it off. 